Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, hello and welcome back to another episode of Hakuna Matata. How's everyone doing? Alright, let's see. Hopefully we got new mail today. Giraffe calf's habitat situation. You've already reported to us about the giraffe's habitat situation, but did you happen to see any giraffe calves? Both Maasai and reticulated giraffes are already at least as tall as humans at birth. If you see one, please don't forget to report it to the head office. Animal called a Garanuk. Robin, is your research proceeding smoothly? Just so you know, we've received information that an animal called a Garanuk is living in Corona Gorge. While it looks similar to an impala, it's long, slender neck and legs set it apart. If you see one, please don't forget to report it to head office. I hear there's a magnificent waterfall. Hello, Robin. This is Kenichi at Equator Tours. If my sources are right, there's a tall, magnificent waterfall in Corora Gorge. Could you send me a photo? It's a travel publicity shot, so I'd actually prefer if you could get the car and waterfall together in the frame. Hopefully you get something spectacular. Cool. We can do all of these. Let's see. Alright, we'll figure it out. Giraffe calves are quite large, aren't they? If you snap a photo, send it to head office. So, did you find any Garanooks in Corona Gorge? If you have any photos, send one to head office. I haven't been out that way yet. Let's uh, go to Corona Gorge, I guess. We'll do a couple things along the way. I think that's how this episode will start. It's too bad the ne weather never changes in this game. I think that's one thing that I absolutely love about it. Currently it's raining, raining outside. It's super nice. Alright, let's hope for maybe some hippo babies. Aha! Maybe the hippo's baby is here. I don't see any baby. Seems like not yet. There's the baby giraffe. And Garanux, which are that one right there in the middle that's going towards the bush. It's probably going to even eat. Oh, no, maybe not. Alright, well, we gotta get ourselves a picture of the baby giraffe. So we'll do that now. Which is not too challenging at all, and I want to get a picture of these guys. So for the Garanux, I'm going to take a picture of these guys now, even before I have the uh, challenge. Actually, I'll take a picture of you guys right now. to be stealthy and stay in here for a bit and I'll see you guys shortly that's the guy I want of course can I get get him without uh, startling him Mr. Garanucked. Oh, yeah. They're very, very, very skittish. Incredibly so. Alright, let's uh, get out of here because I don't think they're actually going to do what I want them to do, so I'll have to come back another time. We are going to grab ourselves a picture in front of the waterfall with a truck. Oopsies! Out of here! <laughs> Just want a picture with a truck.
Why are you guys so close? Get back to where you're supposed to be. Go back. Turn around. You too. Turn around, buddy. This will be a bit of a standoff for us. There you go. Back you go. I need that spot right there. What are you doing? Go home, elephant. You're drunk. There we go. Come on. Yep. Keep going. Almost. Not this way. Wow, your AI is messed up. I've ever seen seen any of the AI messed up like that before. All right, so now we can take a lovely picture right here. Of the truck. And the elephants. And it'll be lovely. Mm. <laughs> Eric does not look impressed. doing that, buddy. Work it. Don't make your pouty face. You know we don't like this. Oh, come on. One more shot. First things first, magnificent waterfall. That's it. That's our money shot. Technique? Hmm. Oh well. A is still an A. And I think it's a pretty pretty picture. Um, we want to send in the... Garanuk. We want to send in the baby giraffe. One more. The Cory Bustard. Mm. 
Oh, root beer is full of sugar. Right, 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 right. Time to sleep. Your name came up for this job. Hello, Robin. A request came in the other day for a certain newspaper. From a certain newspaper. They want a shot of a parent and calf Masai giraffe for the website. Not only that, but their paper asked for your work specifically. That's really something. To get tapped by a major, publica major publication. We'll accept it. Help, I'm stuck again. Hello, Robin. How are you doing? Thanks to the baby... Thanks for the baby elephant photo the other day. It was just what I needed to finish up my picture book. Now I get to ask you another favor. This time I need a shot of a baby hippo. It's tough drawing baby animals. Think you're up for it? Does Google not exist for you? Next we have to snap a photo of a parent and child Maasai giraffe together. Do you know what is the difference between a Maasai and reticulated giraffe? They have different markings. Kawanja Plain is home to reticulated giraffes, and Duma Step is home to Maasai. No, really? Okay. What's the best thing to do here? Hippos. Let's go check for the hippos. Of course, where was that email yesterday when I needed it? Lucky though, we got very lucky. Usually the hippo's not here more than once, uh, two days in a row. So now, if you'll feast your eyes on that cuteness, there's now a baby hippo. Isn't that sweet? Isn't that a tough shot to get as well? I find I find this guy hard to photograph because there's not a lot of Brush. Oh, he's so cute! He's so little! Hippos, you're tough. You're tough, tough customers. Look at how cute you are. Where am I gonna stand? Where are you guys go? Oh, are you going over here? I mean, the AI is very, very... Um... Oh my goodness, you're cute. The AI is uh, hard to calculate. It's uh, randomized, which is nice. I really like it. But it means that I have no idea what kind of path they're going on. This one's a very easy... Easy photo. We don't have to worry too much about this one. Basically, sneak up on the docile giraffes and snap a cute photo of them. Come on, baby. Yeah. Oh, oh, I'm right here. Unfortunately, if I try and move... Let's see. Very tough. 
tough group to get. I still think it's cuter with one like this. Ah, that works. Aw, thanks guys for being so obliging. Okay, I'm going to try and get some more hippo babies before the light fails. Let me go back here. Whoop. Yep. So, manual exposure, we're going to take down to Four, and aperture value we'll put up and we'll see if we can't get some nice hippo babies in a set uh, for the sunset where are you hippo ah there you are I don't think these will turn out because babies move in too fast. I could always use this at my as my sunset photo too. Ah. Like it. That's adorable. Hmm, it's a bit too light, so let's uh, quickly adjust that. this. It's so cool. Yeah, the little camp in this area. still there and if the ox peckers are there ah the hippo family's still here that's good we'll spend hopefully one more day with them I just went really close to one of them behind me. Don't mind me, Mother Hippo. I'm just gonna hide in the bush. Somewhere. This is my chance. This is my chance. Come on, baby. Mom's walking away.
What in the world are you doing? Ah, there we go. I think that is good. Let's take it home. All right. Baby hippo. A. All right. Masai giraffe. I think the one we will take is this one. Ugh, I do not like this one. <laughs> Hello, this is Javi over at IRS Publishing. We need to change one of the photos in the mammal guide. We're working on it, and we need to do it fast. Can you help, Robin? The new photo we need is a Garanook standing up and eating tree leaves. It has to be standing up. Thanks in advance. All right, let's do it. Garanucks sometimes stand on their hind legs when eating tree leaves. Corora Gorge might have the low trees that Garanucks prefer. If you see a Garanuck standing, that's your chance. Alright, let's get a Garanuck. We're off to Corora Gorge. Itchy nose. <laughs> Alright, I'll see you guys there. All right, so this bush here has been, this bush has been my friend many, many, many a photograph for getting a good, a good shot. So that tree that's in the center there is what these guys love to munch on. So I'm gonna hope that I'm not, not overly in sight of them, if I can actually get a sight of them without these pixelated leaves in the way. Alright, so there's there's a lovely boy here. It always amazes me how close they can get when I look over and I see my zoom is all the way out. Tight and wide. Like, look at how close this guy is and he has no idea that we're standing in the bush here. I could totally zoom in on his head and be like, oh, there he goes. All right. So that didn't work out. I couldn't get any good shots. They kept running away. So the other area that I know works, or I'm going to hope works, is this one. Because this bush is the one that Garanux absolutely love. Like, it's the one that seems to be programmed for them to eat the munchies the most. Oh, we got... Garanuck incoming here. Hopefully this boy doesn't spot us. Look at his little whip tail. <laughs> oh, animals. Oh. Maybe he's looking. Oh, please don't go behind the bush to eat. Okay, wait. That would have been sad. And that has happened more often than I care to admit. Okay, so he's coming towards the main bush. Hopefully he stops here. His AI is like, mm, I'm hungry. 
I want some little thorn bushes. Okay, you stop. Oh, yep. I think this is it. We got it. We got some good shots. Look at them on their little legs with their little little tails. So I've never been able to get a super good shot of these guys. I'm gonna try zooming in and seeing if maybe the magazine wants a closer shot of them. All right, I guess that's it. Thanks, buddy. I appreciate the business. And the show. Oh, if you push start, if you guys are playing this, you can actually enter first person mode. All right. Wish me luck, ladies and gents. Let's put this, uh, oh, that's a giraffe for later. Let's put the Garanuk in. All right, I'm gonna hope that these guys are what you want. It's usually I just squeak by with an A. Up, oh, up. Oh. Distance, always the distance. All right, so it's clear that they don't need a full body shot for this one, the sneaky, sneaky game. Congratulations, published in the reference guide, yay. All right, ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for watching. Tune in again next time. We will go see some giraffes necking. And by that, I don't mean making out. We will talk to you soon, so tune in again. Bye for now.